One morning, John was pulling the Hadfield Flyer as usual. He had a guaranteed connection with one of the British Rail trains and he had to stop at Dainting Station. There, he saw Class 86 standing on the other platform. When he stopped, he decided to say hello. Hello, dear. Oh, hello. You surprised me there. Oh, I see. I'm sorry about that. Anyway, the name's John. My name's Jenny. Nice to meet you, Jenny. And you. Anyway, are you that 76 I heard so much about? Aye. That's probably me. Where did you hear about me? From my shed mate. 47289. Oh no, here we go again. So you've met him before? Ah, oh, did actually. He's not the nicest class 47 around, you can. Nah, he's not that bad. I actually dated him. Dated him? Yeah. That's not possible. I think you can say that, because we are trains. He has a point, he can. Well, none of you are right. Oh. Well, yeah, maybe we don't have certain parts, but we've got other parts, like brake pipes and so on. Ugh, that's disgusting. That's life. No, I would have actually liked you if you didn't say that. How? Oh. Was that, that yours? yours? No, no, I think it was, think it was mine. mine. No, no, it was, it was yours. yours. Sorry about that. Come on, old boy. You can talk to Jen later. Alright, driver. John soon arrived at Hadfield, where he left his coaches and continued forwards to Sheffield Light Engine. When he arrived there, he was left at the shed to rest. He was alone, but not for long. Hello, John. Is something wrong? Hi, Edwin. Nothing's wrong, but I need to ask you a question, eh? Okay then, shoot. Do you know anything about love? Love? Yeah, I learned a few things from one of my brothers. But those were unimportant. I don't have any experience with it, to be honest. But I've always kept myself away from it. Not that I don't like it, but I prefer being alone, thinking alone, and sleeping alone. I've got friends and that's all I need. Why do you ask? Nah, I was just wondering. Met a girl, did you? Come on, you can tell me. Okay, then, Edwin. Yes, I met a girl. Her name's Jenny and she's a class 86. Hmm, a class 86, you say? They can't reach pretty high speeds, you know. Don't get me started, Edwin. Anyway, is she Scottish? Nah. That's what makes her so perfect. Oi, John. No, but it's being delayed and where to take one of his good trains. We are also to stop at denting. M maybe we'll meet that girl again. Shut it! John was soon on his way with Norbert's goods train. He soon reached Denting, where he met Jenny again. Hello there, Johnny. John, please. Okay then, John. Why so serious? I'm not serious, that's just the way I am. Tell me more about yourself. Um, no. I've 
got to get back to work and so do you. Maybe another time? Aye, maybe another time. Goodbye, Janet. This time for sure, a spark flew right between John and Jenny. That was probably because Edwin flew right past with the express, but anyway, on with the actual story. John was soon on his way again. He soon arrived to Manchester where Dominic was already waiting for him. Hello, John. Hello, Dom. Um, you alright? Aye, of course I am. You don't sound like you. Are you sure everything's alright? Nah, I'm alright. You know, Edwin did tell me what you asked him about earlier. See that girl at Dinting again? Aye, I did. Didn't think I'd ever have to say this, but I miss the old you. I don't like this new and soft John. Oi, wake up, will you? I'm awake, I'm awake, not to worry. Just return to Denting and ask her out. What could happen? Aye, uh, I suppose you're right. Are there any trains going there? Yes, there's actually a tanker train going there. Okay, I'll take it then. But, what about the express? Is Ricky around? Yes, he's resting at the coaling depot. Well, then go there and inform me of the change, you silly shunter. Okay, I will. John was soon on his way and he soon reached Inting, where, as planned, Jenny was waiting for him. Oh, hi, John. I wasn't expecting you. Yeah, one of my lads broke down and I chose to take his train. Uh, not really. He wants to ask you something. Oi! You want to ask me something? I Jenny wanted to ask you, would you... Well, you say it already. Yes, come on, man, say it! Would you go out with me? Now, what did you say about dating and trains? You've made a bit of progress, John. Would you? Let me see. Mmm, of course, silly. Of course I'll go out with you. And this is how John and Jenny started going out. What does the future hold for them is unknown. But for now, for this moment, it doesn't really matter. Because this is only the beginning. But for now, we have to say goodbye. See you next time.